are we heading today, you? Nanjing. Yeah, we are off to Nanjing. This time to spend more than just a few hours because last time we went, we just stayed for the night to get a flight out there. So looking forward to actually exploring some more of the city. The train to Nanjing was around two hours from Shanghai's Hongzhou railway station. When we arrived in Nanjing, we needed to take the metro. If you don't have the Nanjing transportation app, you'll need cash to get the ticket token from the machine. We got off at Sanshanji to find some lunch. We Hello. are hungry, so we want to go get some duck. Yeah, and some noodles. And some noodles, a nice little lunch. And then we'll explore some more of the incredibly hot and humid Nanjing. Did you get me? Pistachio. Pistachio, and I got chocolate. Mm. Well, it's very rich. But this is like a little chocolatier shop. They have some gorgeous little chocolates, but I didn't film because I felt really rude. <laughs> you can tell this duck place is good because there are so many people outside. Mew, what's the name of this place? Zhang Uh, it looks really good. I mean, he just chopped a duck in half and chopped it up for us. So, yeah, we'll see if it's any good. It's supposed to be the best. So, I'm just following me in the heat to the streets, trying to find a noodle place. I hope he knows where he's going because I'm blindly following him. But he's quite far ahead because he has long legs and I don't. Sausages, um, liver, this is pork skin, and the egg, some tomatoes. And then noodles in the bottom? Yes. Nice. Also some pork, ah. shredded pork. Really get a lot yeah. for it. How much was that one? 34. 30. Mew just said that this pork is the size of my face, and it's true. It's huge. With the temperature exceeding 40 degrees Celsius, we decided to take a little rest in the hotel when the sun was at its peak. We stayed at Your Cove by Hyatt, just a short walk from Nanjing South Railway Station. All the standard amenities and cost around 400 RMB for the night.
after the temperature dropped by a couple of degrees, we headed back out into the city to explore the evening in Nanjing. So after a little rest in the hotel, we are now off to find some street food. I feel like I've been here before we heard the beautiful sound of live music so followed it to a cafe where we stayed for a drink I'll share some of the audio at the end of this video if you'd like to hear more
Since it was dinner time on a Saturday night in the centre of Nanjing, it was difficult to find somewhere to eat that didn't have an hour long wait. So we headed to an Italian restaurant to have some pizza and enjoy the quiet indoors. Apparently this place, the tacos are really good. I feel like they've double done the tacos so that the crispy bit doesn't break. Bon appetit. After dinner, we headed to Catherine's Park for some cocktails. It's so hot. Where are we going now, Mew? We go to a cocktail bar to get us on cocktails. dedicated to Scotch whiskey alone. So this is Mew's cocktail, it's called Why Women Kill. And mine's called, mine's called Embarrassed Wine. The next day we headed out in search of brunch. You said it was the last time But you keep coming back to town Sorry that you take back all the things you said just to hurt me. I love just went cold, but I'm still burning. I love just went cold. Why? I keep on making it's a smoking hot morning here in Nanjing. Uh, currently. 36 degrees but the feel like due to humidity is 43 so we are baking it's just gone 11 on our way to get some brunch and yeah hopefully something to cool us down a bit Mew found us a highly recommended Australian restaurant called No Worries now I have to get over you again Was the last time that you keep coming back to show me sorry you have changed now but it's the same old story I love just went cold but I'm still burning I love just went cold
fish food. Some fish food to feed the little fish. Oh, that's a big one. It's huge. <laughs> and the house is so big. Yeah, I can tell. They look so hungry. <laughs> Holy. <laughs> They're all following me. They were over here. Do you feel powerful now? unfortunately didn't last and we were very quickly back to the intense heat. Tickets to the park were 98 RMB each. This park is very famous for its temples, but we hadn't anticipated how far a walk or climb it would be to reach that area. And on a day as hot as this, we didn't want to risk sunstroke by trekking on. So we gave up. We didn't make it. It was so hot and we didn't know how high up this mountain, this temple was the temples walking 40 minutes on the, under like 45 degrees that's crazy yeah and then so we were halfway up and it was another one and a half kilometers and we only had an hour until we had to leave so it'd be one and a half kilometers up and then like three down because we we're already halfway up so yeah my hands they're still really swollen my hands swelled up Oh, yeah. So Mute, how much did this whole weekend cost? Um, 2035 in total, including all the hotels, um, trains. trains, food, Every time we wanted cocktails, a drink, yeah, yeah. at the bar. All the stuff. Yeah, so everything, that's just over £200. Yeah. And that's for the both of us, so about yeah. £100 each for this weekend. Yes. I think it's worth it. I think it's not bad. Thank you for watching. If you'd like to see us back in Nanjing when the weather's not so hot, please let us know in the comments. Until next time, bye!